Hi guys, my name is José Padilla. I'm the director of the new Robocop. Uh, I'm thrilled to have had the chance to uh, direct this movie. Um, it's, you know, based on the original one. I'm a fan of the original movie because it was ahead of its time, both statically and thematically. Uh, back in 87, it was talking already about automated violence, both in war and law enforcement. And so uh, now we actually have that happening in our lives and it's going to be more and more present. So we already have the drones, uh, now we're going to have um, automated robots doing law enforcement and replacing soldiers in the battlefield. So we had a chance to make this movie and talk about this. Don't forget the movie is on the theaters on February 12th. Check it out. What if I told you that even the worst neighborhood in America could be made completely safe? How do I know this? Because it's happening right now in every country in the world but this one. It is great to see American machines helping to promote peace abroad. So then tell me, why can't we use these machines here at home? Why is America so robophobic? We need to give Americans a product they can love, a figure they can rally behind. We can't put a machine on the street. Forget machines. They want a product with a conscience, something that knows what it feels like to be human. I'll give your mom a kiss. My baby. Too slow, boy. We're gonna put a man inside a machine. Time to wake him up. Make him more tactical. Let's go with black. Quality control, EM-208 versus Tin Man. Wow. We are going to make a lot of money. He's coming. Don't play good cop, bad cop. Bad cop, Robocop. He's undoing what we did to him. Thank you for your cooperation.